Hello everyone, my name is Lisa and this, you already know, is Bookbug and we are here today to bring you a special Bookbug session from the garden and because we're in the garden and it's a lovely day, all of our friends have come to join us so there are a bit more um, activity, a few more characters to see today because everybody wants to get in on the action. So if you're ready, will we start with our hello song? Okay. One, two, three. Hello everyone, hello everyone. Glad that you could come. Ay, 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 ay. Glad that you could come. Hello book bug. Hello children. Hello grown ups. Hello Gruffalo and hello from me, Lisa. Is that Bootbug? Bootbug wants to know why I'm wearing mouse ears. Well, there is a reason, but it's a secret just now because it's going to be a nice surprise later and it might involve our friend the Gruffalo. Are you excited to hear that, Bootbug? Mm-hmm. Yep. He's really excited. He's desperate to know what's happening, but you'll just have to be patient and wait. So, shall we get started with some songs and rhymes? Um, we'll have songs today because we're out in the garden and we're far away from lots of other people so we can sing and you can enjoy the songs at home. We'll also do some rhymes as well to get you looking forward to coming back into Bookbug. Um, when we can do them in libraries again. We'll have lots of rhymes and actions for you. Okay, are we ready for a bit of cross cross to get us warmed up? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Cool breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivery's. <laughs> Well, it's summer, so we're not really shivery, but it's good to shiver when you get a tickle. Should we do it again? Okay, should we face forward this time? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Cool breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivery. <gasps> That was nice and shivery. Okay, shall we do another tickle? In fact, let's do a special tickle. I've got a bag here that's going to help us with our tickle. Should we see what's in the bag, book bug? Uh-huh. Right, let's open up and see. Sing our song. What have we got in the bag today? The bag today the bag today. What have we got in the bag today? Let's have a look inside. And I love these bags. Stars are my favourite. Okay, who have we got? Oh, we've got Teddy. You love Teddy, don't you? Okay, we're going to do one of our favourite tickles and Teddy's mentioned in it. Okay, let's pop the bag down just now. And we are going to do round and round the garden. And you know how we go round and round the garden. Like a teddy bear. Are we ready? One, two, three. Round and round the garden. Like a teddy bear. One step, two step and a tickly under there. <laughs> You're getting a lot of tickles today, book bug. You'll be showering and giggling and all sorts. Right, should we do it in the other hand? Okay, if you're not familiar with a lot of these, we usually repeat them two or three times, so never worry. Right, ready on the other hand. One, two, three. Round and round the garden, like a teddy bear. One step, two step, and a tickly under there. <laughs> right, okay, well, one more time. Can't get enough of the tickles this morning. Okay, one, two, three. Round and round the garden, like a teddy bear. One step, 
to stay, but I took a little to there. <laughs> Rather you than me. Okay, thank you, Teddy. I think we have another little song for you. So if you want to sit here, sit back. We are going to do Teddy Bear is Up. Some of you might know this, but if you don't, I'll do it a couple of times. Are you ready, Teddy? Okay. This is usually best done standing up, but if I stand up, you won't see me. Um, I'll disappear. That wouldn't be very good, would it? So I'm going to keep sitting down. So are we ready for Teddy Bear is Up? One, two, three. Teddy Bear is up. Teddy Bear is down. Teddy Bear is dancing all around the town. Got it? Teddy Bear is up. Woo! Teddy Bear is down. Teddy Bear is dancing all around the town. One more time. Teddy Bear is up. Woo! Teddy Bear is down. Oh, where'd he go? Teddy Bear is dancing all around the town. Well done, Teddy. Okay, shall we just sit you down? And I think we'll have a rhyme now. I haven't had a rhyme for ages. Who are we going to have for a rhyme today? Yep, we're having Incy Wincy, but we're not going to do Incy Wincy. We're going to do something a wee bit different. Okay, this might be a little bit old for some of you, but it's one from my childhood and I like it, even though the spiders make me a little bit funny. Okay, we ready? One, two, three. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider Hello. and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. Imagine sitting on your tuffet, minding your own business, eating your curds and away. Did you enjoy that spider? Should we do it again? At one, two, three. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her. How are you doing? Fun frightened Miss Muffet away. That was fun. Okay, right, I think we'll have a song and we'll have some more of our outdoor friends. Who have we got here? Huh? Our frogs! We've got five frogs with speckles and spots. So I think we'll do Five little speckled frogs. Right, we ready? One, two, three. Five little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Blub, blub. Okay, you got it. Four little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Blub, blub. Then there were three. Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log. Eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. No thanks. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. Blub, blub. Two little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log. Eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. No thanks. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one green speckled frog. Blub, blub. Oh, One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no 
smoking speckled frog, blub, blub. And we're back. Hello. That was good fun. Should we do it again? Okay. I enjoyed that. I don't know if Spider enjoyed it so much, but you know they're not really going to eat you. Okay, one, two, three. Five little speckled frogs sat on a speckled frog eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Blub, blub. Four little speckled frogs sat on a speckled frog eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Blub, blub. Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled frog eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. No, no, no. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. Blub, 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 blub. Two little speckled frogs sat on a speckled frog eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one green speckled frog. Blob, blob. That's that. One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Blob, blob. Oh, those crazy frogs. Okay, I think it's time for another bag. Okay, you ready? Oh, but, but you've toppled. Right. Because this bag is very crucial for the next few things in our session. So, I will sing our song. What have we got in our saddie bag? Do love stars, I think I've told you that already. What have we got in the bag today? The bag today, the bag today. What have we got in the bag today? Let's have a look inside. What have we got? Oh, that's our little mouse friend. You haven't seen mouse for ages. Give him a hug. Hi, a mouse. Right, put the bag over. Okay, ready. I think we'll have a tickle with Mouse. Mouse loves a tickle. He's got a little tickly paws, a little tickly tail. Right, ready? We do it. There was a wee mouse. One, two, three. There was a wee mouse looking for his house. Not here. Not here. But here, here, here. <laughs> told you moose was tickly. Okay, should we do that again? There was a wee moose looking for his house. Not here. Not here. But here! Here, here! Tickle, tickle, tickle! One more time. There was a wee moose looking for his house. Not here. Not here. But here, 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 tickles! You got that out of your system, Moose? Yeah. Okay. I think we'll have a song. Yeah. You ready for a song? This is a song and a rhyme. It's one of my favourites because I like the actions in it. Um, and we'll do it a couple of times in case you don't know it. I think the grown-ups might know it and it's called Hickory Dickory Dock. Right, are we ready? One, two, three. Hickory Dickory Dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck two, the mouse went boo! Oh, I think we all got a fright there. Hickory dickory dock, tick tock. Tick tock, tick tock. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck 
three llamas went wee. Hickory dickory dock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> Did you like that book bug? Should we do it again? Okay. Right, so if you've got a younger baby, they might be a wee bit more comforted if they sit facing you so they can watch your face and watch as you sing and you speak. Okay, so Big Bug will face me, Mouse will do his thing. Right, and we'll do it one more time. Like we're ready. One, two, three. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse fell down. Hickory dickory dock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck two, the mouse went boo! Hickory dickory dock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck three, the mouse went wee! Hickory dickory dock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. <gasps> That was an energetic one, wasn't it? Okay. Right. So, Mouse has joined us. We've had a tickle. We've had a song. I think it's time for our story. And this is why I've got on the mouse ears. And Mouse is making a special appearance today. And why our big friend Gruffalo has come along too. Right. Everybody gather around because we are going to listen to the Gruffalo. That's an old favourite, isn't it? I love the Gruffalo and I especially love the wily mouse in the story. So the Gruffalo is written by Julia Donaldson, illustrated by Axel Scheffler and it's published by Macmillan who very kindly allowed us to read their books out for our video book bug sessions. Okay, like should we get you settled now? You might have to come in and join in a little while. Okay. The Gruffalo by Julia Donaldson. A mouse took a stroll through the deep dark wood. A fox saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have lunch in my underground house. It's terribly kind of you, fox, but no, I'm going to have lunch with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why? Didn't you know? He has terrible tusks and terrible claws and terrible teeth in his terrible jaws. Where are you meeting him? Here, by these rocks. And his favourite food is roasted fox. <gasps> roasted fox, I'm off, fox said. Goodbye, little mouse. And away he sped. Silly old fox, doesn't he know? There's no such thing as a gruffalo. Hmm. On went the mouse through the deep dark wood. An owl saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have tea in my treetop house. It's frightfully nice of you, owl, but no. I'm going to have tea with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why, didn't you know? He has, I think I've got another little friend here that can help us illustrate a bit better. He has knobbly knees. Knobbly knees. And turned out toes. And a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. I think he needs to get that seen too. Where are you meeting him? Here, by the stream. And his favourite food is owl ice cream. Owl ice cream, to it too. 
Goodbye, little mouse. And away, owl flew. Silly old mouse. Owl, doesn't he know? There's no such thing as a gruffalo. I've got two. Aha. Uh -huh. Gruffalos are real. On went the mouse through the deep dark wood. A snake saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come for a feast in my log pile house. It's wonderfully good of you, snake, but no, I'm having a feast with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why, didn't you know? His eyes are orange. His tongue is black. He has purple prickles all over his back. Where are you meeting him? Here, by this lake. And his favourite food is scrambled snake. Scrambled snake, it's time I hid. Goodbye, little mouse, and away snake slid. Silly old snake. Doesn't he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? Okay. Oh, oh, but who is this creature with terrible claws and terrible teeth in his terrible jaws? He has knobbly knees and turned out toes and a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. His eyes are orange, his tongue is black, and he has purple prickles all over his back. Oh, my favourite food, the Gruffalo said. You'll taste good on a slice of bread. Good, said the mouse. Don't call me good. I'm the scariest creature in this wood. Just walk behind me and soon you'll see everyone is afraid of me. All right, said the Gruffalo, bursting with laughter. You go ahead and I'll follow after. They walked and walked till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hiss in the leaves ahead. It's Snake, said the mouse. Why Snake? Hello. Snake took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh crumbs, he said. Goodbye little mouse. And off he slid to his log pile house. You see, said the mouse. I told you so. Amazing, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hoot in the trees ahead. It's Owl, said the mouse. Why, Owl, hello. Owl took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh dear, he said. Goodbye, little mouse. And off he flew to his treetop house. You see, said the mouse, told you so. Astounding, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I hear feet on the path ahead. It's Fox, said the mouse. Why Fox, hello. Fox took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh help, he said, goodbye little mouse. And off he ran to his underground house. Coward. Well, Gruffalo, said the mouse, you see, everyone is afraid of me. But now my tummy's beginning to rumble. My favourite food is... Gruffalo Crumble! Gruffalo Crumble, the Gruffalo said, and quick as the wind, he turned and fled. All was quiet in the deep dark wood. The mouse found a nut and the nut was good. Yep, Mouse I think is the star of the show today. Yep, he's been looking for his house, he's been going up and down the clock and he's outsmarted the Gruffalo, the Fox, the Snake and the Owl. You're some mouse, aren't you? Hope you enjoyed that story. It's one of my favourites. I do like a Julia Donaldson story. I think we'll have a little action rhyme. It's not time for you to go yet. Okay, this is a, this is one you might not know, but I'll do it a couple of times. I think I'll get Rootbog to join me and it's called 
tall as a tree. So, we go tall as a tree. Wide as a house. Thin as a pin. Small as a mouse. Let's make ourselves really small. So we do it again. Ready to go. Tall as a tree. Whee! Wide as a house. Thin as a pin. Squeeze in. Small as a mouse. Crouch down. Okay, right, shall we warm up again with a little song? I think we will do Old MacDonald, but because we're outdoors, we've got all sorts of friends here, we'll do Old MacDonald with a difference. Just get ready, try not to give anything away. Okay, one, two, three. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Oops. Excuse me. Ruffles decided to go for a nap. Start that again. Yeah. One, two, three. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a cow. Seems okay so far. E-I-E-I-O. With a moo moo here and a moo moo there, here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E I E I O. Okay, Old MacDonald had a farm, E I E I O. And on that farm he had a frog, E I E I O. With a croak croak here, ribbit, and a croak croak there, ribbit. Here a croak, there a croak, everywhere a croak, croak. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a lion, E-I-E-I-O. With a roar, roar here and a roar, roar there. Here a roar, there a roar, everywhere a roar, roar. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O Some farm that old MacDonald had. Okay. Right. Little bounce to wind us down. Okay. I think Lion's trying to get in the action again. Shall we move you over here? Okay. One, two, three. Diddly, diddly, dee. I bounce you on my knee. Diddly, a diddly, oh. I bounce you down below. Oh, where did you go, book bug? Diddly diddly I, I bounce you way up high. Diddly diddly do, I love you. <laughs> okay. Okay, a little cross cross to cool us down. One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Cool breeze, tight squeeze. Now you've got the shiveries. Sadly, we've come to the end of our book bug session. Just wanted to mention that if you take books out for your little ones over the summer in the library, you get a free book bug finger puppet. How cool is that? Um, the only thing is they're not suitable for under children under the age of 12 months, but for everybody else, they're absolutely fine, especially for the grown-ups. Have your own book bug puppet show. Okay. Right, so we're ready for are we ready for a goodbye song? One, two, three. Goodbye, babies. Goodbye, babies. Goodbye, babies. Have a lovely day. Goodbye, children. Goodbye, children. Goodbye, children. Have a lovely day. Goodbye, grown-ups. Goodbye, grown-ups. Goodbye, grown-ups. Have a lovely day. It's goodbye from me. It's goodbye from Bookbug. Um, I hope you're enjoying your summer holidays. I hope to see you soon. Take care. Bye.